What's up guys? Just so you know I have a new mic, so that's why I might sound different from my last video, but yeah, um, apparently there is something I forgot to mention in, uh, in the how to make a knife skin for CSGO, and I feel really stupid about it. But there's an, yeah, there's another program that you need called DTF Edit. Oh good, it's right here. But what DTF Edit does is uh, changes or well, saves the skin that you made as a DTF, which is a Valve texture file. What you have to do is click import. I'll use my uh. Hold on. You know what? Let's use my uh. Oh no! Wait, we can't use my bayonetta. We'll use my 5.7 that I made mean, that I have yet to publish. What you have to do is save it as a target file, which is .tga extension, which Photoshop will natively support. Or you could use any of these other supported file types, BPF, BMP, DDS, GIF, JPEG, PNG, and the .tga. What you do is open it and use these settings. Normal format, DXT1, Alpha format, DXT5, Texture type, Animated Texture, have it set to Resize to the to nearest power of 2, Resize Filter Triangle, Sharpen Filter None. And here's the most important thing, have it, have it set with Clamp On, which will resize the image, uh, which will resize the image, have the maximum width 2048 and the maximum height 2048 and leave the uh, generate mini maps as normal. What you do after that, click OK, it'll import. It sometimes it takes a few seconds. And oftentimes like yeah it'll do this. It'll say BTF edit not responding as it tries to get it. But yeah. This is basically it. It gives you a really zoomed in look, which yeah. Also, sorry that I just maximized it for anyone who saw them. What you do now is click save, and then save it as your gun. Save it as like what you want to name it. If you want, put the weapon name in front of it, and then put the uh, then put the name of the skin after it. it. That'll just make it easier on you. The process is always the same no matter what, and I feel really stupid for forgetting to uh put that in, so yeah. That's all we really need to do.